Hello everyone. Uh, in this tutorial, actually, I'm going to show you how to uh, use uh, advanced formulas, how to create your own formula from the scratch. For example, uh, you have like formulas that consists of like other formulas or steps that you want to add. Uh, you can create this actually um, in an easy way, which doesn't require um, VBA coding or macros or anything just plain formulas you can just use this so how to do that firstly uh, you need to have that developer tab actually uh, if you don't have the developer tab you just go in the tab and just right click here and customize and from this make sure that you have the developer tab checked if you don't see this box that's, that's actually not checked so just check it only and press OK and you will find it here in the middle of uh, the other tab. So once you have the developer tab, just press it and go to, to add-ins, go to store and start searching for uh, advanced formula. And you will find it uh, the first one, OK? From Microsoft, just press add like this and continue. Then you will find it here in the home um, tab. So actually advanced formula, it allows you to write your own formulas from the scratch. And here is actually uh, a formula that I uh, created previously actually. So uh, how this formula, like for example, work? Um, this is actually uh, like a formula called lambda, which is like uh, a general way to create a formula, and it has like a uh, placeholder, and then after this you can use whatever formulas you want to use, and use that placeholder, and then later on, that placeholder will be replaced with the uh, field value. I'll show you. Uh, I created like a function like this to uh, create an uh, email. So for example, we want to use a last name plus uh, like any number. Okay. And then uh, we, on, we want to use that last uh, name to create the email. For example, if we have this one, so we can use it like this. I want to add example.com. So the final result actually should be like this. So you can do this using uh, like a lot of functions. And for example, you need to expand them or make like one big function. But here we are actually doing this. But we are using lambda, so lambda it will take like uh, the parameters, the placeholders firstly, and then it will take like any like uh, number of uh, formulas you want to add to it. So it is pretty easy after this to use. For example, instead here we have in this cell that it takes the full name and it splits the last name only based on the space so you can do this actually but instead of using like b2 or b3 you just uh, write that we have like a full name we will insert later we don't have it now so we will just insert uh, and do this later on but for now we have that full name we can use it as a placeholder until we insert the real value so for this one we have for example uh, split the value using this one, this formula. And then after that, we added a code, for example, this A. We can actually use like a code from uh, that one. For example, uh, the first name, we can take like the first letter. So we can write, for example, left. And then we use full name again. And we use the first letter to generate like uh, a number besides that name 
and then we add joins at example.com or like for example any domain like something like this and once you have it written like this one you can actually like try this with a lot of other formulas we can change this later i will show you now so just uh, once you have it go to our here in the manager you will find it like this just press this one like sync names it will add this formula and once it is added actually it is ready to be used so once you write here see uh, create email it will show up here in this uh, formula name and it will ask you to put the phone name so we just select the phone name close the bracket and that's it we got our uh, formula and it works exactly as we want it so this uh, actually uh, like join it by using is like and sign so we can use actually uh, another one which is like for example you want to use another format like uh, text join so instead of using this one you can just add like this and uh, the editor here like um, text join and then we want to say um, like nothing to join between them then to, to ignore uh, it's empty data and then for example we take this we uh, put it here we add one comma and we take the second formula we add it here and we then add another comma and the last one is take this part we need to remove that add so like this and we have formula our formulas inside the text join so we need to register this and once we edit this we can just press this one let's try uh, to change this part turn it to example again so sync it one more time and you have it as example so it worked actually the same way so uh let's say like you have like full name and you want to add something else later you can use for example um, like if you want to enter uh the domain name for example you can say domain here and instead of that example dot uh, com you just write remove this part and make it domain so later on that formula it will require you to uh enter the full name and the domain name and from that part you can actually uh generate uh whatever like for example this one we will add like uh, domain we can use this one and here we corrected it so should actually uh be removed and here we go we just uh like converted it to whatever for example you need to change this to domain it will change it so that's it for uh this tutorial uh, if you enjoyed it, please uh, share and subscribe and leave uh, a comment if you, if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.